pearl weed. I love this plant. It's such an easy plant. Pearl weed, some fats on it. It's from North America. It can go by the names Baby Tears, Pearl Grass. It's easy to find. I think you can find it at Petco, um, online, all boost plants. I think Aquar uh, Aquarium Co-op even has it. Anyway, easy to find plant. Place it anywhere. It's a stem plant. Requires a eh, medium-ish light. Water parameters, wide range. 6.5 to 7.5 pH. Temps anywhere from 66 Fahrenheit to 82. It can tolerate soft to hard water. It is such an easy plant. Like, I'm not joking when I say easy. So, this plant does not require CO2. Lighting does, however, factor the growth of this plant. So, if it's really high lighting, you're going to find that it stays pretty short. If it's really low lighting, it's going to grow tall because it's just going to want to reach that light. Some will say that when you're carpeting with this plant, you want to be careful. If it grows too long and dense, it'll become one giant mat and float up from your substrate. I have not found this to be true, but maybe that depends on the substrate that you're using. To propagate, take a trimming from the stem you cut, put it between your tweezers like so, and shove that down into the substrate. When doing maintenance and you're trimming your carpet, there will be some yellowing or browning right where you have trimmed. That will go away within a day or two, so don't worry about that. I would say this carpet probably took a good seven or eight months. The only reason that's the case for me was because when I first started out, I bought this one little culture cup of pearl weed. It showed up and it was really bad. It was mostly like rot. So I got a few stems out of that, propagated that, then propagated that, and so on and so forth. So my best advice to you is if you really want a good head start, definitely buy as much pearl weed as you can. Because um, two mates four, four mates eight, if you get what I'm saying. This plant does grow very fast. You will be trimming it quite frequently if you do plan to keep it short. So also keep that in mind. Otherwise, it is one of my absolute favorite plants to keep. I love my pearl carpet. If you have any questions, hit me up in the comments. I hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you for watching.